good evening welcome to kpb coding hub in today's video we are going to start um, pattern programs okay patterns patterns or pattern programming in python so if you are very good at looping statements we can able to write patterns by using these loops okay so for this a basic functions are required let us take one function among those is nothing but range it is going to take two parameters n1 and n2 you know very well this particular function in python will generate will generate numbers from n1 to n2 minus 1 where n1 is inclusive n1 is inclusive whereas n2 is exclusive means if you are taking a range of 1 comma 7 it will generate the values like 1 2 3 4 5 6 it won't take the ending value second argument it is not going to take it will take up to 1 to 6 so it will wind up with 6 itself based on this i want to write or i want to prepare some patterns patterns we are going to write so let us see the first pattern here what i am going to display is pattern number 1 the first pattern i want to draw a pattern like this uh, total in first row i want to take six stars and in second row i want to take six stars in third row i want to take six stars like that six into six like this i want to take for this we have to write a python program let us see how we can construct a python program for this i am going to save this folder in test I am going to save this python file in test folder. test.py is my python file name. For each i value in the range of 1 to 7. Just now I told right. This loop is going to execute how many times? 6 times. I want to print a message called hi. Can I run this file? Yes. You can open a command prompt. So from this I am moving to test folder. In this folder, I am executing the program py space test.py. As you can see, I am getting how many messages? Six times I am getting the message called hi. I don't want hi, I want a star in that place. So, just if you run this program, what will happen? This message is going to be displayed in how many times? Six times. Now, I want to display end is equal to space end is equal to space if you take end is equal to space then what will happen it will print the star separated with the spaces it won't go to the next line in the same line it is going to print all these six stars separated by space end attribute will stop sending the data to the next line it will be printed on the same line sir one loop is okay but my requirement is what i want to print stars in this style in the first row in the first row i want to print six stars like this immediately the control has to come to the next line in the next line i want to print another six stars in the next line another six stars like this total how many lines we have to print six lines something like it is a six by six matrix for much so that's why what I am going to do is I will write one more inner loop for j value. Why? Because I already we used i j value in the range of 1 to 7. I want to execute this task. That's all. So total 6 into 6, 36 stars got displayed here. Sir, I don't want all these 36 stars. I want 6 stars followed by new line followed by six stars like this just i am printing 
empty line so that what will happen after printing every row the control will transfer to the next line after printing every row the control is going to transfer to the next line so that we are going to get a stars in this style sir this is our requirement or yes in the first row six stars in the second row six stars in the third row six stars like that a total six rows if you want you can take 11 here if you take 11 what will happen 11 10 by 10 because 1 to 11 means 1 to 10 so total a 10 by 10 10 rows 10 columns total 100 stars are going to be displayed like this this is nothing but the first pattern program that you should aware how we can able to draw this pattern okay in the next video we are going to see the second pattern how you can able to draw of course it is coming from this basics only we will see how you can able to draw by removing some stars i am going to take another frame and i will explain okay right thank you please subscribe to our channel kpb coding hub thank you